Hi guys, once again welcome to Summon Share Farms. My name is Fred. Today we are going to continue our series of how to start a cattle farm in Ghana and the episode of the ratio between cows and bulls. Stay tuned. Welcome back guys. As I said before, today we are going to be talking about the ratio versus bull and cow. And before we start going into research and so on, I want to tell you what we have here. And then based on that we can dig into what is right and what is wrong. Um, so today we are at the cattle farms and we are going to go ahead and look for our bulls. At the moment we have at this ranch about let's say 30 um, cows. So uh, we have a whole lot of population, but we have 30 cows now, and we have exposed them to one bull. So let's go, let's find our bull. And today you're gonna see um, Yaya, who is our headsman as well, in our video today. So come with me. Um, so. Come, come with me so this is our bull so this is the guy that I've been doing all the great job and I want to show you this sir we we've had him for about um, let's say a year now and we before we actually purchased this bull we had bought about three different bulls which um, we didn't like till we finally found this guy very active he does the job so bull is something that most of you don't pay attention to but in this video i want us to explore it more further and know the importance of a bull to your livestock and 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 the impact it can make on your calves this guy here is three years old and about six months there is a natural rule of thumb that you know it's used in the western world and even in ghana about how to select a bull for your cow mostly the the, the rule of thumb says that the the number of month of your bull is actually the number of male females which is cows that you can give to the bull so let's say if your bull is 18 months then you want to give at least about 13 to 18 cows to that bull so if your bull is two years, that means it's 24 years. So the maximum cow you want to, that bull to cross is 24 cows. So you can give as low as from 10 to 24. But mostly I would advise a two-year-old bull to cross your entire herd. So mostly what I will do is three-year-old bull. And with a three-year-old bull, I match him to at most 30 cows. And that is what the term is. But depending on the size of your bull, Mostly in Ghana, I know you wouldn't know the exact age of your bull, but mostly we'll use the size um, to tell. So whenever you're thinking about starting your cattle farm and you've purchased your cows and looking for your bull, I would advise you to go for something below three years if that is the one bull you're gonna have. So as we showed you this bull, we have another small bull um, here who we are hoping will cross the moment this guy is done. So that is the black one there. So this guy is definitely going to grow out of age, right? At some point. And we will need to get somebody to replace him to do the job, right? So the black one there is what we are hoping will replace him to do the job in future. It's a very fine breed. I like the color and the way he's growing. Aside that, as you can see, we already have some great um, calves coming up in our um, ranch. And we are really looking forward to today replacing this guy. So as you can see for the whole ranch here, we have only two bulls. Therefore, don't spend too much money on bull. Take your time and look for the right bull that you think you like and you will like its calf. So that is what we want to offer you today. 
thank you for your time and send us your comments give us your feedback on what you think is right or not you know and if you haven't subscribed to our youtube go on the button below and subscribe thank you for watching and make sure you go to our facebook as well if you're not also following us on facebook see you next time next week bye bye